My friends, you are about to see my exact net worth in April 2023, including how much crypto I have, NFTs, cars, real estate, and all my liabilities, including debt and what I'm doing to make money now and uh, inspiration. If you are, hate your net worth and you're tired of where you're at, what I'm doing this for is accountability. Ever since I've started publicly sharing my net worth, it has went up every month because now everything I spend money on, I think how's this gonna impact my net worth. I am intending to be a millionaire someday and I'll show you how far along on that journey I am. So we're gonna go through everything I've got, everything I owe, and this is combined with my wife because I'm married and what's mine is hers and what's hers is mine. So let's start off with the big stuff. My home is worth $480,000. We have about 20,000 in cash in the bank and uh, about 30,000 in retirement accounts. Now my wife has most of the cash and most of the retirement accounts because I have no retirement accounts and I dump everything into crypto, NFTs and my business. So if you wanna see my stuff, I have a $5,000 or so in studio equipment. So filming right here, all these monitors, the most valuable thing in this office is probably these two PCs. I have a gaming PC and a streaming PC, which is a gift. I love what I do doing this every day. Our cars are worth about 24,000 according to Kelly Blue Book, and that's combined with a cheaper, older Toyota and a newer, more expensive Toyota. And we have about $4,000 in a health savings account and a high deductible health insurance plan my wife has. Now, uh, here's something you probably might be surprised about. This is, I've bought tens of thousands of dollars of NFTs on Immutable X for a game called Gods Unchained. Now, I bought about 6,000, sold, and then in the last month, I have rebought about 2.2 Ethereum worth of NFTs for the game Gods Unchained that I stream on Twitch. So every most every day from 9 a.m. Eastern to 11.30 a.m. Eastern, and then some other times, sometimes on Thursdays, Fridays, and the weekends, I'm live streaming Gods Unchained. We have a great audience, and I think this is the very best crypto NFT game out there. It's the only game people actually watch in pretty good numbers when I play on Twitch. And uh, this is a business expense then, because it's advertising, it's things I'm using on stream, and if I ever sell it, then that's income. Otherwise, it just goes to zero. Now, uh, this is my DCA and crypto portfolio. I started in December 2022, and uh, it's doing great. I'm up $2,000, almost 40% profit. Zen has crushed it. I bought Zen at the bottom, made a video, told you guys to buy it at the bottom. My Zen is up 7x from where I bought it, plus I minted a bunch as well. My top two positions are Ethereum and Bitcoin, and I intend to fill these up much more. These are almost, uh, sh these are asymmetric investments that have huge amounts of upside, and uh, there probably is almost no downside. My DSO and internet computer positions have also just pumped in the last few days, which is great. I think those two are way undervalued. I've also been given some crypto. So the Dex Tools team was kind enough to send 800 Dex after I bought $50, which is a couple hundred dollars in Dex. And uh, the Impulse X team sent me what is now about $800 or so in Impulse X as for consultation, and maybe I'll share a video when their new uh, update is live. So I've got about $1,000 in crypto that was just given to me that I didn't ask for, they just gave it to me. I also, the last crypto I had before my DCAing portfolio, I had this project billing itself as a new version of Hex, or Hex with AI. It recently is totally tanked, which actually knocked out 500 or so out of my portfolio this week. And I have a few hundred dollars in Hive that I constantly sell it, but I just keep getting more of it all the time. So I have about 300 in Hive that I am constantly getting rid of. I think Hive's absolute trash. And uh, at the same time, it has provided thousands in, in, in passive income because of how the delegation works. So in summary, we've I have about five, we, my wife and I have about 5,700 
at five thousand five hundred thousand seventy nine dollars in assets over half a million in assets for which i'm very grateful and uh, then we need to get into the liabilities how much money we owe so we do have a good bit of equity in our house we bought our house five years ago and uh, the real estate market has pumped since then so we only have about two hundred and forty thousand on our mortgage at like three percent which is awesome and we have business loans to the SBA, which I essentially used to pay down the higher interest rate stuff by converting all my spending into the SBA spending and then using all my income to pay off. I've wrecked my finances and business 2019. SBA loans have been a lifesaver. Those are at 3% as well with extremely low payments. At this rate, there's no point in paying any of these down because inflation, it'd be better to just buy into things like Bitcoin and Ethereum that can grow because with the debt and inflation, this debt will be meaningless in five or 10 years in terms of you know, the value of it. So that is our liabilities. And I'm very excited to say our net worth is $7,000. So we have 7,000 more in assets than liabilities. And this is a huge milestone for us this is the first time our net worth has been positive since 2018, which was the only time in my entire life I've had a positive net worth since I was 18 and first started taking student loans. Huge lesson. I would absolutely encourage everyone never borrow money to go to school. It's one of the worst ways to borrow money. Getting education is important, but just get some cheap free education. Never borrow money to go to school. And uh, this, the, our net worth went up $25,000 since March, which in a month is amazing progress. And uh, that happened, the house, according to Zillow, went up like $18,000. I'm like, I don't know why that went up right now, but okay. And then uh, my uh, wife stacked up some cash herself. I stacked up some crypto. And uh, we uh, are on the way to being millionaires one day. Uh, it would only take 40 more months like this and we would be millionaires. We'd be millionaires in about four years if we keep stacking up just like this, which is amazing going from zero. And the net worth is up $47,000 since we started tracking this. I had a you know real come to Jesus conversation with my wife. I'm like, look, I'm sick of being having a negative net worth. I'm tired of our poor spending decisions, especially mine, but mine have set the bar too low for you. You've made poor spending decisions too. Here's the poor spending decisions you've made. Here's the poor decisions I've made. We need to be accountable. We need to start showing our net worth and committing to increasing it because it's just dumb to have your to be consuming and spending all the time. So if you, the book, the, the main book I read that helped me make this change was Everyday Millionaires. It explains exactly what people do to become millionaires, which is one, work and earn a consistent income. Two, or you know, whether it's through a business or your job. Two, invest at least 15% of earned income consistently over time. So DCA constantly 15%. And then three, keep spending to, an, especially on pure consumables, to an absolute minimum. Buy a house that's much cheaper than you can afford. Buy a car that's cheaper than you can afford. Buy the cheapest groceries you can buy. Spend as little as possible and accumulate. And uh, the main way I uh, have been making money in the last month is on jerrybanfield.com. I launched a crypto coaching community, which formerly was a millionaire mastermind. I changed it to a crypto coaching community because almost everybody that joined really is interested in crypto. Crypto, I see, is the fastest possible way that you can build in an investment portfolio today. And that's why we focus totally on crypto now. And I also just launched a creator coaching community as well. And this YouTube channel, I was... I used to put my net worth reports on my main channel, but that channel sucks and hardly anybody watches it. This is the main channel y'all watch on now, and well, this is very relevant. So this channel's been an absolute blessing. I started this channel from zero in December 2022, and I mean 200 and some thousand views, all organic traffic, thousands a month already in ad revenue, 
on a brand new channel. A huge thank you, especially to Joe Paris. Uh, probably a thousand to three thousand of the subs came over from Joe Paris featuring me. So I really appreciate you watching all of this. My goal is to make the smartest, most useful crypto videos for you every day. And uh, this, to me, the importance, the point of this video is transparency, showing you exactly what I'm doing myself so that, well, my the best example I can teach is what I do. So I'm stacking all the cash I get into crypto constantly and uh, continuing to build value in real estate. My wife is then diversifying our strategy with putting money into regular retirement accounts where she has stocks and health savings account and holding cash. So between the two of us, we have a very well-rounded net worth building strategy. Thanks for watching all this. I love you. You're awesome. I'll have another video tomorrow at 5 p.m. Eastern for you.